Stay tuned as we test out what the mileage is on this Honda Civic Hybrid with the Sport Touring Package. Hey there, it's William West Hopper from The Real DC Car Guy. And this week we have the pleasure of road tripping in the legendary Honda Civic Hybrid from Washington DC to New York City. So join us as we go up I-95 into Manhattan and see what kind of mileage we're getting on this Civic Hybrid. So we're out on the highway here on I-95 between Baltimore and Washington DC. Um, traffic is heavy here on Columbus Day 2024. Um, handling on this vehicle has been great. I really like how uh, responsive it is, how um, it, it has a nice light feel to it, but it doesn't feel like it's going to get blown off the road uh, with these big trucks going around. It's hard to believe that since the early 1970s when I first remember seeing the little Honda two-door car that people thought were just two Honda motorcycles stuck together. It has become this, the 11th generation Civic. Behold, the 2025 Honda Civic Hybrid. You can either get it as a sedan, as we have it here in a sport touring package, or you can get it in a sporty hatchback. So let's talk Civic Hybrid power. With 232 foot-pounds of torque, it is the most powerful non-Type R Civic ever, while earning an impressive 50 miles to the gallon. So where are we on mileage? Right now we're at 50.3. We have 376 miles of range. We've gone 66.3 miles. We're going through the Baltimore Harbor Tunnel on I-95. What I'm really liking is the sense of safety suite that I have throughout the vehicle. Really do know what's around me, what's happening. I'm looking at my dashboard here and I see the blind spot information system is working very well. It's telling me what's going on. I also see what taillights are on or off. Now this car is new, so it's not gonna have a burnt out taillight, but I could tell there, because it's gonna tell me on the dashboard what my taillights are doing and what my turn signals are doing and what my headlights are doing. So that's just something really, really good. The thing that I'm really getting a kick out of for this little Honda Civic, which I never, ever thought was possible, is it's fun to drive. It really is a lot of fun to drive this car. I really thought a Honda Civic was nothing more than just a econo box, but not a fun econo box to drive. I, you don't think of econo boxes as being fun vehicles to drive, but this one is. For those of you who like sporty cars, the Civic meets that. Check out the Type R Civic. Not a hybrid, though both the hybrid and the Type R are a lot of fun to drive. And driving fun is what you want in any car, even a fuel-sipping hybrid, which is known to be boring. The Civic is a car, while so many other manufacturers are not building cars anymore. They're just building crossovers and SUVs. Honda has a long history as a manufacturer of motorcycles. Automobiles, though, started in 1963 with a mini car, the N360, something we never got to see here in the USA. And that Civic really is what started the front transverse mounted engines and front wheel drive that many automobiles use today. All right, so here we are sitting in traffic yep sitting in traffic while the other side moves along smoothly and the main side does not yep they're moving over there and that's where i was and then i moved over here thinking this was better not a good move so we're in the heart of new york traffic or actually i should say new jersey traffic now um, the nice side thing about this vehicle is the size is good. You can get in and out of traffic and zip zip around a little bit. Um, the bad size is that because it is small, some of the larger vehicles try to intimidate you. But I um, think that's kind of classic. That's classic New York driving. Just have to deal with uh, the craziness that that is Manhattan and New Jersey on the highway. But so far, I've got to say this Honda has been has handled itself very well. So let's take a look inside the Civic to get a look at the impressive refreshed interior. 
The dash looks pretty nondescript until you take notice of the latticework details. Built into that is the air vents with three controls in the center, the right, and far left. The steering wheel has impressively designed switches. The center console has two very usable cup holders, an old school automatic gear shift with drive modes, and an electric parking brake. And yes, wireless device charging right there in the center. The center mounted 9 inch color touchscreen is a tad old school looking like a monitor sitting on the top of the dash. The leather trim seats are surprisingly comfortable but could use a bit more support for longer drives like the one I'm on. This tester had an operable glass sunroof with a fabric shade, all standard on this trim package. And the 12 speaker premium sound system was a great addition while driving this Civic. So we're on our way to Lincoln Tunnel. Yahoo! We're, we're going to get into the city now. Use the left two lanes to take the Lincoln Tunnel exit. You take your life in your hands here, because they come at you from all directions. Go down to two lanes here. I think there's four lanes coming out, but two lanes going in. Going into New York State and Manhattan. Um, you can sort of see the interior of the vehicle here. All right, so this is sort of the last leg of our adventure driving the 2025 Honda Civic Hybrid uh, Luxury Touring Sedan or Sport Touring In Sedan. Feet, use the right lane to take the exit toward 34th Street. Use the right lane, 40, oh, I can't get over use there. Use the right lane to take the exit toward 34th Street. Well, that would be great, Street, but I'm over here. Use the left lane to take the ramp to 42nd Street. Use the left lane to take the ramp to 42nd Street. That's what we're doing. All right, we're in the big city. Welcome in to New York. Feet, turn left onto West 42nd Street. In 800 feet, turn left onto West 42nd Street. Yep, so this is the city. So we're in Manhattan now. Yes, this little car is doing fine in the big city. How are we doing on our on our phone charge? Nice that it has uh, wireless charging here. I'm going to pop that in there for that and see if it's going to is it going to char charge my phone a little bit? Let's see. Yep, there it's charging a little bit. We've been in econ the whole way. Let's see uh, what our 49.1 uh, average fuel economy. Uh, for th for this trip so far All right, so here we are at our destination. I'm gonna pull in find this hot this parking spot This is lower uh, champion parking Run a lock. Come on, hop in. I see you got a, uh, looks like 49.3 miles per hour. I was hour. getting 50.6, but I drive like a maniac, so, and I wasn't gonna slow down for them. Anybody. Gotcha. Perfect timing, we're ready for you. I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this episode of The Real DC Car Guy as we took a look at the 2025 Honda Civic Hybrid in sport touring mode. This is a sedan that, for many, may be just the right vehicle for you.